everybody, this is the number one potato bus coming at you with a new update video. Um, this is to talk about the upcoming set review. Uh, we've got a very special announcement for that, but just before then, I know some of you were looking forward to the podcast, and as I wrote uh, on the Facebook page, I am unable to record the podcast, edit it, and release it due to other life commitments. As well as just trying to record the set reviews and trying to get them out. Um, yeah, it would have been pretty much impossible to record the podcast and release it along with everything that we're doing now. Uh, and we apologize if anybody's looking forward to that. But let's get straight into it and talk about our set reviews. As you guys may know, we did do set reviews for Opus 4. And we're also going to do it for Opus 5 with our exclusive Crystal Point rating system. Where we have, you know... Uh, points for the actual card and synergy points uh, to give you the most information about the card so you can you know try it out and judge it for yourself and see what are the top cards are available in Opus 5. The twist is that we got some very special guests for each element okay now these are in no particular order first guest I want to talk about is actually Mr. Worldwide the world champion himself Toby Henriette. A lot of you may know him as the person who won the 2017 Final Fantasy TCG World Championships. And not only that, he's also known for his infamous Ice Earth deck uh, with the Onion Knight. As well, he's also known for, for showing us how strong Mono Ice is on the Octagon Open. The next guest is a world competitor, Milan Cup winner... Joshua Freeman Birch. Uh, he is very well known in the Final Fantasy TCG community for being a very high, uh, highly skilled player as well. And he's won the Milan Cup with his infamous Fire Ice list with the Sid Rain starter card. Um, also, on top of that, he also piloted the Ice Lightning deck that got up to second place in the, in the latest Octagon tournament. Next guest that we have is none other than... From Team Starwind, Wolfgang James. I'm very excited to have him on for his great personality and entertaining YouTube videos, mostly doing dual series. So you guys should go check it out uh, on Team Starwind. Going to be linked in the description. Next up, we got somebody who has the highest liked and followed Final Fantasy TCG dedicated uh, Facebook page, Pedro from Band's Final Fantasy Corner. I mean, there is really nothing more to say about him. He's a staple in the community, uh, brings Japanese meta news. Uh, he posts, you know, all sorts of spoilers uh, and uh, puts up deck lists of his own, you know, brews. Uh, you guys should go to his Facebook page and go give it a like and follow. Uh, very excited to have it on. The next guest, which I believe has the most subscribed YouTube channel, that does Final Fantasy TCG content on a regular basis is Six Sages Gaming's own Matt Cosmer. Very excited to have him on and to give us his opinions. And not only that, I think he's got a very special project coming up. So if you guys like Final Fantasy TCG, all types of dual series, you know, deck spotlights, all those sorts of things. Go check out his um, YouTube channel and go to subscribe. Next up is another YouTuber personality, which I personally know got a lot of people into the Final Fantasy DCG, is Joe Hill from Josepher. He has his own YouTube channel where he does many deck profiles and a lot of good introductory videos for new players and started Deck Evolves um, series. So you should go definitely go Check out the YouTube channel and subscribe and give it a like. We have gathered all of these amazing guests so we can have them on the Opus 5 set review. So don't forget to subscribe and follow us on the Facebook page so you don't miss out a video over our Opus 5 set review where we have all of these guests. But now you may be wondering, what element are they doing? <laughs> so why don't you comment down below what you guys think it is? And the first person that will get it right, I'm going to put it to the top of the comment section. And yeah, that's about it. Um, so next week, get excited for our Opus 5 set reviews. They're going to be lots of fun, lots of uh, very informative with these amazing guests. 
So don't forget to follow and subscribe all of them. And yeah, I'll see you next week for the Opus 5 set review. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, like, share this video. This is huge. Number one potato bus, out.